I'm Arif Kamal. I'm a palliative medicine physician and medical oncologist at Duke. Palliative medicine is a specialized field focused on quality of life issues with patients with cancer who, um, and other serious illnesses. As an oncologist, I have a background in treating cancer patients, and so I understand the unique uh, worries and concerns and issues that they have and want to bring that quality of life focus to those who oftentimes have never been through a cancer experience before. So my job is to help them think through it and talk through it and, and plan for all the things that can come along the way. I realized that um, there are several of my colleagues focused on the chemotherapy aspects and the prevention aspects and, and other components, but um, that we need to focus just as much on the quality of life aspects. And um, I realized that that was my calling because I've seen uh, you know, patients and, and what kinds of needs they have and realized that we need a large team to take care of them and their caregivers and their family, and, and I feel like I'm an important part of that bigger overall team that takes care of them. I think for patients and families, what, what I want them to understand is that everybody with a serious illness is eligible for palliative care, and that I don't have a specific agenda when I meet with patients and families. So oftentimes we might start very open-ended. I'll introduce myself and say what kinds of things I focus on, and then I'll ask them what's important for them to talk about. And then we'll put aside the next 60 minutes, 90 minutes to talk through what's important to them. I'm not there to talk somebody in or out of anything, but I'm trying to help them match what they're looking for with, with what's available. In many ways, we plan for the worst and hope for the best, which means that we think about all the things that could happen down the line and make sure the things that might be unexpected we talk through so that they're not so unexpected anymore. Ultimately, we want to build hope and help patients understand that hope can change over time. 